Hello everybody, this is Detective Daddy from Boston, Massachusetts, and uh, this is part two of my 29th box of pennies for 2019. I unfortunately received a call, so it ended the video. Uh, so far, just do a little recap. We have eight wheat pennies, I believe the old oldest is a 41, 14 Canadians, no 09s, nor any IHPs. Yet. Uh, the last two boxes, I found a total of five. Indian head pennies. Still can't believe it. Let's see what else we find in this box. I'll be back with the next find. Okay, everybody, we're on roll 29, and I just found the ninth wheat penny of the box. Let's take a look. Kind of banged up a bit. Let's take a look for a date. 1953 Philadelphia. All right, on to the next. Okay, everybody, we're on roll number 30, and we have our tenth wheat penny of the box. Take this one out of here. There we go. Let's take a look. Let's see what we got. And there we go. Another 1944 Philadelphia. All right, on to the next. Okay, everybody, we're on roll 32, and I just found something I have never found, but something my daughter Lillian found just uh, about a few weeks ago. Look at this. A 1943 steel wheat penny. How cool is that? This is my very first one I have ever found. That is awesome. That'll go right there. Wheat penny number 11, roll 32. On to the next find. Okay, everybody, still on roll 32, and we have our 12th wheat penny of the box. This is starting to heat up. I like that. It's got a little bit of wear to it. It's been around for a while. Let's take a look for a date. Yikes. I'm going to have to clean this off because I cannot make a date out on that. Give me just a second. Okay, everybody, hope you can see this as well as I can. That is a 1953 Philadelphia. Okay, on to the next find. Okay, everybody, we're on roll 46. We've gone a little bit of a dry streak here, but we do have our 13th weedy of the box. Let's take a look. It's looking a little worn, a little beat up, actually. Let's see what we got for a date. Another 1944 Philadelphia. All right, let's see if there's any more left. Okay, everybody, just open up roll 48, and right in the back, right back here, a wheat penny fell out. Let's take a look. This is wheat penny number 14. There we go. Ooh, looking a little beat up. Let's see what we got for a date. Another S mint mark, 1948 S. That is awesome. On to the next. Okay, everybody, still on roll 48, and we have our 15th wheat penny of the box. Let's take a look, see what we got for a date. It is beat up. That looks like a 1952 Philadelphia. That could be a mint mark. Give me just a second. Okay, under larger magnification, there actually is not a mint mark there. However, still a cool find. On to the next. Okay, everybody, roll 49, 16th wheat penny of the box. Looks like this box here wants to go out with a bang. Let's take a look for a date. There we go. And that is a 1957 Denver. I believe that's a 57. I don't think it's 37. Looks like a 57 to me. On to the next. Okay, everybody, this box is done. And we ended up getting was 16 wheat pennies, 23 Canadians, no 2009s, nor any Indian head pennies. So my Indian head penny box streak ends at two. That in itself is just unbelievable to be able to say. Anyway, I'll be back with the wrap-up.